Hey Sans, got another test for you. So yes, I am fast and I am diligent for you guys. I want you guys to get as many tests as you can. So, got another Raditz test here. So, you guys want to go ahead and test out the power of potty. Uh, a pot, I almost said the pot, the power. <laughs> I almost said potty body. <laughs> potty body. Power body uh, with Majin Buu AI and costume 2 versus uh, also Raditz with eternal life and costume 1 also with Majin Buu AI. So, of course, with the whole Season 6 thing, Power Body is being allowed, and I, I think I'm getting uh, Power Body mixed up with Ultimati. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Power Body pretty much means that you're not really stunned by, you know, power hit moves, like the charge up hits. Now, that doesn't seem OP, but, you know, as long as there's no Ultimate Body, because Ultimate Body is, I, I think it's kind of OP. Unless, unless I'm, I'm seeing right now, I'm trying to see if uh, he gets affected by normal strikes. I know he's getting kicked around. That's what we're looking for. Oh yeah, yeah, he's not being phased by uh, his opponent's hits. Yeah, I think that's kind of OP. That's just me personally. I don't. I, I think that's actually unhealthy for the league that you really can't phase your opponent. Like, look, look, look how hard. I mean, despite the eternal life winning, look how difficult he is to getting off combos on the the power body. Yeah, I don't think we should bring this back. That's just me personally. Look, look at that. Look at that. Like nothing. Like not being being able to be stunned by freaking uh, hits is kind of OP, and we banned it for a reason. I think we banned it when Kid Buu smacked the crap out of the Earth Defenders, and I I think it was either season three or season four, and we were like, yeah, you know what? That's unhealthy. You know. And really, then it's unfair if you only allow certain characters to have it and other characters not, because then it's blatantly unfair. Really, the item is just unhealthy for the game. So, personally, I don't think it should be back, but, you know, who am I, right? But I play Yu-Gi-Oh, so I know about unfair. <laughs> so, now the part power body has, you know, came back, the internal life is healing them, but it's kind of hard for him to get off melee combos. Look at, look at that. Just takes kicks and grabs him. Now, you know, cause I, I would, how would people feel if you know we put that on like Kid Boo or something? You know, it's just you know, kind of like, yeah, you know what? Maybe we shouldn't do that. So, I don't know. I don't know who to talk to about this, but I, like I said, personally, I don't think it's healthy. I think we've been fine without it. It got banned for a reason, and it really didn't need to come back. Like, look at that, look at that, not even phasing him, not even phasing him, it's ridiculous. That guy, he just doesn't care. This is really a un- this is unfair, this is- this, I, I wouldn't even say that this is a fair fight. This is just blatantly unfair. I think it's over. Almost over. Eternal Life is barely keeping him alive, here's a present, dodged. Punch him. Both going max power, but they're at B ones. Dude, just hit him. Oh, okay. Well, apparently when he's in max power, he can get stunned. Top class warrior connects and it's over. All right. Let's go ahead and do round two. So I hope it's just not me. I hope that you guys also realize that maybe this shouldn't be how. You know, if it was just striking moves like charge up hits, then I'd be like, yeah, okay. You know, using four points. But when it's when it's also striking moves, because when you read the description, it just says it says uh, smash moves, doesn't it? I can't remember. I can't remember. If it's smash moves, then it's fine. But striking moves, you know, striking moves are one of the key components of this. Of, you know, Dragon Ball Z League, and to just not be phased by them and, can, and be able to continue your combo is kind of OP. See, look. He would have got phased, but because he had a freaking power bounty on, he was unfazed and pretty much was able to jump back and throw that B2. Look at this. Look at this. He should be, you know, getting hurt being phased, but because he had that power body, he's kind of unfazed. I mean, the Eternal Life didn't really capitalize on it, not that he really could, to tell you the truth. I mean, he could have sat there and kind of punched the crap out of him, but in the end, it really wasn't done much. So, I don't know who to, I don't know where to file a complaint, or who to file a complaint to, I guess to Squee, but 
I don't think it should be brought back. Not at all. So I'll, prob I'll probably message them when I, on my free time, and be like, "Yeah, you maybe want to consider." That. I mean, I'm. The thing is that I'm not part of the the staff, so I really can't vote on anything. So I'm kind of wondering who the hell voted on putting this item back, you know? Because I know Squee probably said no because he he remembers what Kid Buu did did to his entire team. Kid Buu was a monster, and it's all because none of the Earth Defenders could face Kid Buu. And we already know Kid Buu is a great male. Oh, Kid Buu's great at everything, but we already know Kid Buu is a great mailer. So just being able to just put power bounty on him, make Kid Buu unfazed, and then continue on with the mailer is just ridiculous. Sansol, why do Sansol? You're already unfazed. So I guess now they're both unfazed. Yep, it's just gonna be one big old just beat off because neither of them are phased by the melee game right now. So I got you guys probably like, no, don't, don't bring it up, don't bring it up. You, I, I, I'm, I'm just, I'm just going for the health of the game. And you know, if anybody would want power up body back, it'd be me, cause you know I'm on the boost. So Kid Bill obviously would be wrecking face with that. But I, I just, think, I blatantly think it's unhealthy. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna bring it up, and maybe they'll decide on it because I, 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 I think that the item is unfair in general, and I also think it would be unfair if you just only allow certain people to use it, cause then you're just giving them a blatant advantage, and really. There's no bad team in Dragon Ball Z. Like, there's no team that's so desperate that they have to use the item. Wow, I thought he was on the ground. And pretty much over, so Turner Life survived as long as he could, but clearly the power of pot power... I keep on saying potty body. <laughs> power body is just too strong, so... I'll, I'll bring it up, because... Please don't ruin Season 6 for me because of power body. You know, because they're going to realize that it's OP, they're going to try to ban it mid-season, what's the point, why don't we just keep it banned, you know? It, it, this is the thing, it was banned for a reason. Should be over, I don't know why it's taking so long to pick, there we go. Alright, so what did we learn from this video? That power body is OP, but I have no say, you know? I'm not going to be like, oh, a power body test, I refuse to do that for you guys, can't do that, so... Uh, we're just as long as you request tests for power buddy, I'll keep doing them. I'm not happy about it. I don't, I don't, I don't condone it, but I'm just a tester. What do I know? All right. So, if you guys got any more tests that aren't full builds, oh um, no, that are full builds but aren't, you know, max HP because you got to request that for DMZ. Uh, you know, go ahead and uh, type it, and I will try to get the test up to you as soon as possible. So, thank you guys for watching this video, and I'm looking forward to some more tests from you guys. Thanks for watching.